Hello and welcome to the Clockwork 42 channel. My name is Benjamin. Today we are playing with Action Force. This is a weapon set from Valiverse and their Action Force line, which includes every weapon that is being released in their first wave of action figures. So I will clear off my workspace real quick here. And we'll get some figures down here. Come one. Come on, trade in those old flimsy warp weapons for some brand new Crimson Shadow technology prototype weapons. We got a lot of figures down here. I'm going to test these out. Some G.I. Joe, Marvel Legends, Fortnite, Icons, Storm Collectibles. Let's dive in. Inside the package, there are several more packages with all of the different weapons and accessories that go with them. We're going to work our way down the line, starting with the first one on the right. Take a look at the LNG. Do a quick comparison with a LNG from the Marvel Legends Punisher, I believe. And no, they're not the exact same weapon, but similar. Similar in style. Do a drop test real quick, then I snap the bipod on there. The ammo box ports in on the bottom, but it doesn't have the ammo that connects it to the weapon, unfortunately. We do have grenade launcher and the cylinder rotates. That's a nice feature. And you'll notice as I go along, the details on these weapons are very well defined. Adds a lot of realism to your figures. Plus, they're just fun to have. And try out the LNG. And of course, the Punisher has no problem gripping a lot of weapons. His hands are made for it. Close them around a bit. Let them let him show it off for you. Work it. Da -da 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 Moving on. A bag of pistols. First thing we do, see how they fit in the holster. And you'll have to try out with different holsters on figures you have if you have weapon assortment. Some things work, some don't. 1911 in the sky holster, no problem. In the back holster, it can fit in there, but it's not a tight fit. And of course, she can grip it. Looks pretty good in her hands. I'll try out the Desert Eagle. You kind of wedge it in to the holster, but the barrel is long. It's kind of thick at the tip. So, if you see, it stresses out the pouch if you force it in there. Neat looking pistol. Try it with the shield agent. Something that looks kind of standard issue. You try the Glock style pistol in the holster and get it stuck. Don't go in as deep with the 1911. Try the revolver. The trigger on this one is kind of far forward. It's a little hard to get his finger up and over it. Try a rapid raider. I had a feeling this would be a good fit. I like it. I'll have to tighten up the grip on her left hand, but in her right hand, no problem. That'll be fun. Try that out on the Baroness. Kind of loose in her hands, kind of a thin grip on this one, but to take it well enough, she likes it. Bag of blades. Check this out. Okay, I know Warpath, big figure, probably the wrong figure to be trying to test fit, but I wanted to see. So 
for my own curiosity. I can grip a couple of them, but they just look small because he's a bigger figure. Articulated icons, however, he looks pretty slick. I like that. I got a smaller utility knife. Icons have no problem holding a lot of mitt of different weapons. Comma, scythe, sickle, and the bowie knife that was too loose for Warpath. They all look pretty good with him. And latest edition grips him pretty well. They would definitely need a paint job to fit in with him. The plain black aesthetic just, just doesn't work. Bag of rifles. Start off with Jonesy and the SMG. I'm already liking this. Have some fun playing around with that. Some details on the other side. Try out the AK. Oh yeah. I like this even more. I think that's going to be his new weapon. That looks really good. Not quite sure what this rifle is, but I think it fits on a sci-fi character, something futuristic. Not bad, of course. I'm going to try the shotgun with Ghost Rider. He can grip it well enough. He seems happy. Nearing the end. The last set of rifles. Attach a magazine. Attach a magazine. Look how easy this is. Just grab your little magazine. Grab your little weapon. You just push it in there. And it stays. Now, I didn't do this test with all of them, and you'll see that in a moment. And you do get extra magazines. Those look nice in the, in the background of your displays. Old Man Punisher trying out these. This good old M16 with a grenade launcher. I'm probably totally wrong. That's all I know. Let's try Commando Odious. Getting them from all sides. Black Knight. Oh, he appears to have lost something. We'll see. I have a loose one. Before I freak out, I'm just going to grab a different magazine out of the box. Put it in there. It's really easy. Give him a little shake. And then I'm happy. He looks pretty good with that. Watch out. He's coming. A lot of great upgrades for a lot of figures. I'm glad I got this. Action Force, Valiverse. A lot of fun stuff. The figures will be releasing this summer, maybe? I can wait. I'm looking forward to this. A lot of fun stuff. Scale of fun to 10. It just took everything to 100. Thanks for stopping by. I hope you had fun. I did. And look at them. They're all having fun, too. See you next time.